What's up YouTube, Yo Gang, welcome back to the channel. So today we're gonna talk about a, could it qualify as a, mm, I guess, how to, well, I shouldn't say that, but I do have a Mossberg 590. I just got the Mossberg, this is the Maverick Cruiser. And uh, they looked very much similar. Um, except one has a pistol grip this one has the pistol grip and i was quite interested to find out how exactly um do they compare within the two because i already have one so today we're talking about that mossberg maverick cruiser with the pistol grip this one has an 18 and a half inch barrel and it has a capacity of seven plus one so i oh let's run through this really quick you in your box you have your lock and your manual and your shot 12 gauge shotgun comes in this film right here very nice packaging although it is a cardboard box but we're not gonna go through that cardboard box situation today I just don't feel like it okay so there's really not much to it here's your pistol grip your trigger your safety is right down here it is a pump action and i am just so ah how well is that gonna do i am very interested because this style pistol grip is something that i don't have and i want to know would that help with control how is it going to feel in my hands um and uh depending on the heat meaning how hot the rounds are all we have today is two and three quarter but we do have some quite heavy uh one is uh 16 10 people 1610 feet per second which is this federal blue box we do have some ko these are slugs also two and three quarter and some fioki uh dynamic defense uh buckshots so i am interested to see how much better is the control with this uh 590 style shotgun y'all like it i think it's pretty cool looking it's gives me that whole Harlem Knights feel in my opinion but you're gonna find out how well this pumps how smooth it is and um if I like it there once again price point is super super low so if this is something that you're interested in just know it's not gonna break the bank so with that being said uh, I already discussed what it is that we're shooting we are in a safe and controlled environment we are at the gun range and we are going to get ready to do what? Suit them up so we can set them down range. All right, so let's go in lowest to highest. We'll save the slugs for last. So the lowest we have is 1250. I normally do not have any issues with pump action shotguns as far as um, how hot they are, meaning the feet per second. Um, when it comes to pump action now if we're dealing with anything semi-auto i tend to have a little bit more of issues with that so we're going to go in with bioki first and see how this runs oh this color is beautiful Let's see how this runs how y'all doing today everybody good great I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. I'm not even going to play with it today. I am just going to go ahead and put me on some gloves and see what it do. All right. Now we suit it up. All right. Mossberg Cruiser. What we going to do? Let's find out. Pistol grip feels good. I feel like that would allow me to have uh, that control on it. So we'll find out. First shot. Definitely. Not bad. Not bad. You definitely got to put some umph in it. Let's make sure this is clear. She's clear. Let's reload. You got to put some umph in it got to uh wrist wise i can feel the kickback in my wrist uh which is not a problem that's just showing that i have control i feel something flying around my head why isn't this loading 
There you go. Yes, you have to make sure they are pushed down very well. There you go. Feels good though. Quite fun. Uh oh, we'll pick that up. All right, we're still shooting that Fioki. Definitely nice. She's clear. Okay, let me correct myself before we go any further. It is a five plus one making a six shot. Uh, so it is a six shot shotgun. <laughs> nice, 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 nice. Let's make this uh, really quick go ahead and add that that one to get that six in here so that's our plus one and yes you have to push them down very firmly as you can see it's a little tight and there's a little lip right there that you have to cross For the most part, I really enjoy shooting shotguns. Uh, comfortability, it's really not the most comfortable because we have to shoot from the, I mean, you don't have to shoot from the hip. I'm gonna try to hold it up a little bit and see um, how that feels. All right, let's move in with 1610. These are a lot hotter. And see how this does. He's gonna kick. All right, that's my max. Let's see. How does it feel? Oh, holy. Wow. Oh. Oh. Holy shoot. Now, shooting something this hot will definitely put a working on your wrist. That is hot. But I'm gonna give y'all one more tube though. Dang it. <laughs> that almost feels like a three inch. Holy crap. It's hot. Why can I get this in? Feels like it's stuck. Hold on, let me get this out. Shouldn't be happening like that. All right, let's try it now. See, it's still not. Pushed forward all the way. Yeah, something going on with the tube. Come on, Mossberg. Y'all should be better than this.
All right, let's try it again. See why this tube is not feeding. Yeah, the tube is not feeding. Come on. I know it was a nice price point, but we shouldn't be experiencing this, um, especially not with no pump shotgun. Put one in first. Now remember, once you put one into the tube to give it that plus whatever your max is, your firearm, your rifle or whatever is hot. So please be careful. This shotgun is on safe. Let's drop that in there. Push that forward. And my tube is still stuck. Let's get this out. Y'all ain't hear that. Huh. Interesting. Interesting, but I'm not happy. Let's see if we can work this out. All right. We know that the pump is moving. It's moving and it's allowing me to drop one in the head, per se. Try the slurps. It, it can't be low. I can't load it. There's something going on with the tube. If you see right here, it's not allowing me to push. Like, there's something wrong with the spring almost. And it's not allowing me to load the tube with... It's pushed forward completely. And it's not working. No, look. I can't even push it with my finger. Well, it looks like my range day is over. Uh, not happy. But it shot the first... That was what, 22 and maybe it might have given me a little over 30, but that should not have happened at all. I would expect something like this out of a semi-auto, uh, not so much as far as um, this type of um, dysfunction, but uh, pumps don't do this. Pumps don't, it, pumps are not supposed to malfunction. Again, not sure what the problem is. All right, I'm not even gonna get into it. I really wanted to shoot those slugs. Um, this Federal was really doing a job, but there's, it's, it's, don't, mm -mm. Leave it alone. Leave the cruiser where it's at. If you need one, get you a 590. Um, that runs anything. I wanted to do a comparison between the two, but it looks like it won't be happening uh, unless I figure out what the problem is with this cruiser. Uh, no. Nah. Save it. Save it. Put it towards something else a little better because this, this ain't where it's at. Sorry, Mossberg. I uh, usually have, you know, really good things to say about y'all, but y'all fumbled on this one big time. Big time. And a lot of people go to shotguns for home defense. And this is definitely not something you want to encounter um, when you're in a situation. Uh, this is the Model 88. So it's that Maverick 88 Cruiser. Mm. No. Cheap. Yeah, it's cheap. It's really cheap. It's a couple hundred dollars. But... You know, I hate to say you get what you pay for because I have ran into some really good uh, budget, whether it's pistols, shotguns, really, really good budget firearms. And I have no issue with them. And like I tell y'all, I don't have a, you know, a preference when it comes to anything because I enjoy firearms so much. I want to experience all of the different, what they would call calibers, in, in companies that is producing firearms for us. And this is why I, you know, not 
I definitely won't say, oh, I didn't buy this. Oh, I only bought this for the review. No, I didn't buy this just for the review. I bought it because it's a Mossberg, it's a pump, and it has a pistol grip. I, I thought I was gonna really enjoy that. For the most part, the first few rounds, it shot very well. I did find um, the action to be a little stiff, but as I kept getting into it, um, it was ejecting and loading the shells well, as it should, but um, uh, we have come to a halt and I don't like it. So my review on that is save your money. Um, it partially worked, but y'all know I love it when things work. It has to work for me to love it. Um, but Yolk Gang, make sure you check out www.yolkgang.com. Make sure you pick up a patch, support the channel. This is how I make this stuff possible for you guys. And y'all already know I love y'all for life. Peace.